That's right, Felicia and Todd. I talked to a woman outside the house. We were at the home earlier today, and she tells me words cannot express how that feeling's feeling, how the family's feeling right now. Officials with the St. Lucie County Sheriff's Office say this was an accident. They say this happened just off of Green Dolphin Street Sunday night while the children's father was asleep inside the house. According to an incident report, when that father woke up, he found the two boys, both three years old, in the backyard pool. The father and another person on scene began CPR. The boys were pronounced dead at the hospital. Experts say accidents like these highlight the importance of pool safety. It's devastating. It's sad. It, you know, it affects the whole community. Members of the Safe Kids Coalition, the St. County Sheriff's Office, and the county are teaming up to teach every kid how to swim. It's, it's very sad. Um, there's layers of protection that I believe every community member here in St. Lucie County needs to go ahead and take, and we would just like to promote the swim program. The county is also providing pool safety alarms. Families are encouraged to come out during spring break and the summer to take advantage of the program. We've had six fatal drownings in St. Lucie County this year. So looking at our ages, we're looking into expanding it into parent-child swim lessons so that we can get the younger children in the pool. And that woman also told me at the home that the father, he is extremely distressed right now. She says that he is a mess. In the meantime, again, investigators say this was an accident and experts tell me that accidental drownings are the number one cause of death for kids between the ages of one and four. Reporting live, Angela Rosier, WPBF 25 News.